Now, INEC Chairman Professor Mahmoud Yaqub has announced that the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, will continue to collaborate with the media to end democratic governance in Nigeria. He stated that the Commission does not believe in our censorship and will continue to monitor fake news, stating that INEC will work on reports and analysis on elections. Only last month, the Commission conducted 48 elections made up of nine by elections and 39 rerun elections in 26 states of the federation, involving three senatorial districts, 17 federal constituencies, and 28 state constituencies spread across 8,934 polling units in 575 wards located in 80 local government areas with a total of 4.9 million registered voters. I've said repeatedly that there is no election season in Nigeria any longer. Elections are held regularly and all year round between one general election and another. A very important reality in today's age of information technology is the spread of fake news and misinformation instantly and on a global scale. As I said on many occasions, INEC does not believe in censorship. Now, Dr. Chris Ziguzo, president of uh, the Nigerian Union of Journalists, uh, has also urged INEC to collaborate with stakeholders for credible governorship elections in Edo and Ondo State, aiming to reduce citizens' trust in the electoral umpire and uphold the scar sanctity of the ballot box. Let us commit ourselves to the noble ideals of democracy, accountability, and civic responsibility. It's also important that we work together tirelessly to ensure that the forthcoming elections in Edo and Ondo states, as well as future elections, are conducted with the highest standards of integrity, fairness, and transparency. Together, we must uphold the sanctity of the ballot box and safeguard the democratic aspirations of our nation. It is hoped that our collective efforts will pave the way for a brighter, more prosperous future for all Nigerians. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.